hold here, boy. Whoa, easy. Come here. Go on. Try and take me out again. See where it gets you. Go on, have yourself a quick nosy. Oh, you got something for me? After a little tchotchke, are we? Stay safe and quiet now. Lily Millet, you know where she is? No, no. You have any idea of the hole I'm in? Oh, come on! Why's it always gotta be such a goddamn performance with you? Now, I told you I'd get you the money next week, and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say you'll make it next? Don't you take that tone with me. I thought you said you loved I me. I do. I do. But what I get paid ain't enough for one person, let alone two. Your money's got to be your problem now. The only problem I got is this bleating going on in my ear. Now lay off it, Lily. God damn it. Lily, where's our money? What? That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper! Give him what you've got. 
I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn murder! Son of a bitch! or not no please no i presume that means yes now walk away while you still can keep that mouth shut all right fine i'm out of here just gonna disappear don't make me come after you Okay, boy. What? Hey, mister. What happened, ma'am? My horse threw me, and I landed on my foot, and I heard a snap. My leg's all numb. My leg! It hurts so bad! Hands up now! Hey! You better uh, take this! Let it You bastard! You are uh,
Idiot. Hey, you missed it. Out of my face. Go on. Hey, you, hold up. Hey, stop there a minute, will you? Where do you think you're going? Okay, boy. Okay there, boy. It's me! Wondered when you'd roll back in. You been bringing in money? Of course I have. Okay, well, good. Okay. Hey there. Glad you take good care of that horse. Sometimes I think about the old days. Seems a lifetime ago. Sure does. Uh, things all right? Uh, not so good. It's you and me both. Tilly! Hey, Arthur. Oh, Driscoll. Uh, hi. Mary Beth? Hey, Arthur. How's it riding? Not very good. 
I hear the most wonderful words in my head, and then I write absolute poppycock. <laughs> but I love it. <laughs> yeah, me too. My journal. I was reading some the other day. <laughs> I write like a fool. <laughs> One day I'd love a beautiful fountain pen and a great desk in a quiet room and to write the most beautiful stories. Well, I can't do much about the stories or the quiet room, but maybe I'll find you a pen. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Sure thing. How you feeling? Okay, a little better. Good. How are you? All right. Hey, do you think... Do you worry? Do you worry that maybe we've lost our way? How do you mean? <sighs> Ignore that. I won't pretend ignorance. I know just what you mean. But I don't know. Things seem bad. The world is changing, and... I'm not making much sense, am I? No, but somehow you've summarized how I feel. It, it seems awful, and then it seems the same as always, and then it, it seems like there's just no other way, and I, I Listen, just... Listen, we got out of worse situations than this. Done plenty of bad things that we've all forgotten about. Sir! Don't take Dutch's patter about redemption too seriously. We're doomed, just like every other creature on this rock. But unlike them, we'll go down fighting. Is that what you believe? I don't know, son. I don't know what I believe. Apart from wishing I wasn't going to find out sooner than I'd like. What do you think, Arthur? I don't do too much thinking, Jose. Killing's more my thing. I don't believe that for a second. <sighs> we have to keep the faith, right? What else is there? Exactly. We ain't done until we're done. And we've made it this far. Folks seem really happy now. Sure. This. This is everything. The whole world is in a smile, Arthur. <laughs> Remember that. Uncle. I need if you Arthur dying, Morgan. How do you plan to repay me? Oh, you are a heartless little swine. You really are. It is for his own good, Mr. Morgan. I'm sure.
John. Let's get on. Good. And you? Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See, Arthur? Ain't that dumb. Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. <laughs> 